saw you didn't care about the party Wishing all of these people would just head out so we can talk I could tell by the smile when you asked where to write your name on my wall Wish I met you at 16, wish I could have taken you to prom Better late than never I see us spending days together Sketching pictures up and singing songs Wondering what I did before you came along Or you're just what I need Oh yeah Yeah Somehow it keeps getting better I waited forever Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel or if you are new, hi I'm Taylor, thank you so much for clicking on to today's video. As you would already have seen, today's video is a move-in vlog. I am a second year Bachelor of Science student at the University of Melbourne and so I have moved from Sydney to Melbourne to live at Residential College. That is what this video is, I'm so excited about it. If you saw my pack with me video, which if you haven't you definitely should go and watch that first, you would have seen that there was a bit of uncertainty around COVID and if I would actually end up in Melbourne and I am filming this in April. I know it is very late, I'm sorry, but I am filming this in April and there is no COVID and I made it here. And funnily enough, just before I was leaving, COVID had cleared up. It was all looking really good. We were ready to go. And then not even 12 hours before I was about to get on my flight to Melbourne, Melbourne went into a snap lockdown, which is what they do here in Australia to eliminate any cases really quickly. So we went into a five day snap lockdown where basically everything was shut. And so I flew from Sydney straight into a lockdown here in Melbourne, but we were really lucky here at college. It's kind of a bubble. We um, can still see each other. We just had to wear masks around and stuff. So it was all fine. And as you will see in the video, it all cleared up. And obviously now here we are COVID free in Australia and there have been no lockdowns and I'm still here. So this time last year I wasn't. So I'm very happy to be here. The other thing that you would have seen in the video was that I was actually placed in a temporary room when I first arrived at college and then the move-in process was basically just me moving all my boxes and suitcases from that room into this room. So I didn't really film anything from the flight because it was kind of boring, nothing really happened and also there was nothing really with my family. Um, I just kind of got here by myself and then went into my temporary room and then moved into this room. So that's where all of the action is happening. But this video is split up into two. So make sure you are subscribed for Friday's video. It's more of a kind of shopping with me and decorating my room, which you are already seeing a sneak peek of behind me. So just ignore this and make sure you are subscribed for future videos like this and to do with college life and uni life here in Australia it's very very different to America so hopefully a few of you will find that a bit interesting but I think that is all for now enjoy the video and I will see you then <laughs> and that suitcase and I've run out of coat hangers I don't know how and because of lockdown we can't go and do any shopping at Kmart or anything so which is really annoying um, because that's like the most fun bit but um, I might do like a click and collect order from Kmart and get coat hangers and other fun stuff but it's just not as fun as walking around Kmart and buying things that you really shouldn't buy <laughs> and box all my clothes are unpacked this is the sitch not enough storage for what I need there's enough space but just like 
I need a few more drawers, I need more coat hangers. And then I've also got all of up here to put stuff in, but I'm going to put my suitcases under my bed right now. Um, I think that's a good one. Actually, I'm going to move my bed around. So I might do that first and then put my suitcases under. I'm going to move my bed from here to here in this corner. It's kind of weird, but I'm going to try it out at least. Then if I hate it, I can just put it back here, but I'm just going to try it out. And I might also just put my bed sheets on. <laughs> Okay, so basically, it's weird. I'm gonna have this little cute corner over here, kind of really cozy, put a lot of pillows there. Um, and then during the day, make it more face this way, like the bed, like have the pillows sitting up there. And then when we sleep, I guess like sleep here and this way. But um, I don't know, I'm just gonna test it out. It could be cute, but it could be also not <laughs> um and then i put that there and i was thinking of putting like a little plant up there and putting some cushions here because this is like the perfect seat um so if i was to like sit here then you know just like if people were to come in my room or whatever but we'll see i'm gonna try it out i just realized that my dinner and everything are still in the boxes so i actually need to get that out first <laughs> everybody so so far I've actually done quite a bit I've done all of my clothes I have done my bed um, I obviously still need to get some different cushions to make it a bit more colorful and I also actually need a bed sheet I didn't bring a bed sheet but I just use my other doona cover as a bed sheet I've kind of got everything over here cleaned a little bit and then I'm just gonna go through these boxes and allocate them to the different places so like if they need to go over to my desk or in the bathroom or stay over there and then I need to go and do the bathroom stuff and then that's basically it in terms of like organizing everything and then I get to decorate which is fun so I'm not gonna decorate just yet I'm just gonna like put everything in its place make sure everything has a place and then I can go on to decorating as much as I can with what I have obviously because I can't go to the shops right now I also thought I'd just show you these two boxes these big ones I'm gonna try and organize them a little bit better last time and at home they were all like really random but I'm gonna have this one to be a useful box so like um, pegs and like my allen key and some batteries and screwdrivers and stuff this one can be all my random decorative other stuff that I want to put away better late than never I see us spending days together Sketching pictures up and singing songs Wondering what I did before you came along Oh, you're just what I need The best part of me Somehow it keeps getting better I waited forever But better late than never Hey guys, so I thought I'd give you a little bit of an update on what the room is looking like. I thought I would just give you like a little tour and kind of point out what I want to do with everything. Okay, so starting at the desk, so just to give you a bit of orientation, this is where you walk in and that is the desk there. So um, it's actually looking pretty clean and nice. There's a pin board up here um, and I've got just put some fairy lights on today. 
which you've seen me do so that looks really nice and then yeah I don't know what I'm gonna hang up there yet but I do have my masks up there right now and then I'll probably put like uni stuff or I don't even know but um yeah that's really good to have out there and then in here I have a drawer oh, a drawer which at the moment I've just put some like random stuff this is the rest of my stationery and then I have some snacks that's not mine so this drawer probably will get sorted out at a later date but it's fine as it is at the moment and then underneath I have just some laptop stuff here my diary and then in here I just have what I packed in there so just it's um tech stuff so I might keep this box as my like little tech box and then underneath I have put my little file cab my file drawer things <laughs> and then all this I will organize um later kind of I don't really know what I'm gonna put up there but um at the moment there's just random stuff down here is really messy though I have this ugly chair I'm not gonna lie so I've got a bin which is fine but this situation just isn't working moving over here this area I don't like the chair um, but I think I'm going to just get like a white kind of throw and put it on it or some cushions or something and kind of cover the blue up a little bit. Then I just put my Nespresso machine there. I can't even use it yet because I don't have a milk frother or milk or coffee pods because I haven't been going to the shops. But um, eventually I need to get this set up somewhere. Maybe I was thinking up here. So then I also have my fridge just over here. I wasn't going to keep it there because it's really ugly and out of place. But it's also so loud. And I don't know where to put it in my room that's going to make it um, not like, you know, as annoying when I'm trying to go to sleep. Bed, it's, I'm, it's so ugly right now. It was so pretty today outside and I wish I filmed this then. But... The blinds so ugly but the view I hope you would have seen is so so lovely it's just a big tree that's really green and gorgeous anyway so yeah right now this is the bed situation then over here this is gonna be like my little bed side table situation and then I have this little gap here which I think I'm gonna put plant and then on this wall um, you would have seen me today trying to put up these string lights I'm going to wait. Toby comes on Saturday, which is so exciting, but he's going to help me because um, you kind of need two people to do it. So I thought it would be fun if we could do it together. And it looks like it's going to fit perfectly across and then just over across there. And then on this wall, I think I'm going to put some photos along that. That wood bit is there because that's actually the bed head. And then I don't know about these walls. That's just there for now. Just because I need someone to put my bags and those hooks are there already. So then I've got my storage things under here. I don't know what's going to go under there, but that's where that's going to go for now. And then on top, I have just my jewellery. Then in the bathroom, it's fine. There's just little things missing, like I need a shower caddy, which I was going to bring, but I didn't. I want a bath mat in here. I need to organise this, so I'm going to do this tonight after I filmed this little video. I don't think I even told you that we got out of lockdown here in Melbourne. So um, by out of lockdown, I mean that we went down a stage so we were in stage four lockdown now we're in a stage three restrictions kind of thing that was just such a relief and yeah all the shops are back open now so we can go to Kmart and Ikea and all that stuff so I'm so excited to do that already I've written this massive list of stuff to buy Thank you. 